Abdominal migraine is a form of migraine that occurs mostly in children aged 3 to 10. Approximately 3% of children experience abdominal migraine, but it is often misdiagnosed. Adults can also be affected by abdominal migraine, but generally migraine in adults presents with more typical symptoms like head pain. To receive a diagnosis of abdominal migraine, a person must have had at least five recurrent episodes of moderate to severe dull pain in the abdomen, usually around the midsection or belly button. The person must also have at least two of the following, nausea, vomiting, paleness, or loss of appetite. Typically, a headache is not present. An aura may occur before the abdominal symptoms. Each attack generally lasts from one hour to three days. A person with abdominal migraine will have complete freedom of symptoms between attacks, meaning that these symptoms do not linger. Children with a family history of migraine are more likely to develop this condition. Abdominal migraine may spontaneously resolve for some, but unfortunately a large number of those with abdominal migraine will develop another form of migraine later in life. Abdominal migraine is diagnosed based on a thorough history of both the patient and family symptoms and exclusion of other causes. It is helpful to let a healthcare provider know if the patient has had an aura prior to an attack. A provider may order lab tests, stool samples, and an abdominal ultrasound to rule out other possible diagnoses. Cognitive behavioral therapy may be a helpful treatment option in children. Stress management, proper hydration, and regular sleep patterns can all be beneficial for managing abdominal migraine, especially in children. Increasing fiber has been shown to reduce the number of attacks of abdominal pain. Avoiding common food triggers such as chocolate, MSG, caffeine, and cheese may be beneficial. A common abortive therapy is nasal sumatriptan. It is not approved for pediatric use, however, some doctors may still prescribe it after assessing the patient. NSAIDs and acetaminophen are common treatments as well. Anti-nausea medications are commonly a part of the treatment plan due to the high prevalence of nausea and vomiting. Propranolol, topiramate, ciproheptadine, isodafin, and flurnerazine are preventative medications that may be prescribed for abdominal migraine in adults. For more information, visit www.migrainedisorders.org.